Magic is back at Board Games Daddy. So the two uh, Winds of Eldraine Commander decks have arrived. Fade Dominion and Virtuan Value. So you know this video and the next one I'll be unboxing these two puppies. Thank you. Let's go and see what is inside Fade Dominion. So the first thing we notice is that although the shape is similar, these Commander decks now have a different package. Uh, it's smaller, I can tell you. It's smaller than usual. And you don't have that open window here where you see the Commander card. Uh, still, it's expected for you to have a Collector's Booster Sample Pack inside. And two uh, Commanders, the primary one and the secondary one. So, you have a, a little bit of what you can expect here. Summon Flocks of Fairy, so this will be a Fairy deck. And Play Tricks, whatever that is. There's some foiling there on the colors and again here let's see if we have everything that used we are used to have so the cards the deck box yes i love them the tokens commander a life wheel <laughs> strategy insert and reference card what is a reference card let's see maybe those that that's those quick quick help guides Punish all Uter's Pass, battle your friends with powerful creatures and spectacular spells in Magic's most popular multiplayer format. Form an alliance with Tegwil to enhance your fairy forces and replenish their numbers with, with card draw. Amp up fairy army strength over time and beguile your foes and overwhelm the board. While Link charisma like a blade, Tegwil sets its ambition on the high fake card and there she is or he is i don't know so it's different from this guy here yes the artwork looks slightly yeah the hand is in a different position so i guess there are different arts okay so i'm going to open on the bottom because i want to keep this this will look very good when on the, the deck box to identify the deck amongst the the remaining ones when you have like 50 decks you really need help to identify them and what's happening here okay let's pull a strip aha you still have the secret message small fairies big trouble big trouble okay now we all also push the same way uh, pull the same way mm -hmm. comes out nothing there Okay, I'm curious if this is the first one that I'm opening. So, oh, no crappy token. Oh, there are. <laughs> I should have saved my speech. Okay, so there's an envelope. Let's start with this envelope. Oh, okay. There's the collector booster. I guess I, I cannot wait. I'll just go here and see what comes out from here. Very carefully. Very carefully. Save the string. Okay. So, crap that always comes in. Card of Lock Twain. Okay, so there's a commander card there. And compulsion from the the second second set that comes in. I don't remember the name. Okay, the deck box. I was now I'm very relieved because when I saw the size of the oh, there's the thing is here, the life wheel. When I saw the size of the box, I thought okay, I thought maybe they are starting to get rid of <clears throat> the components. But please get rid of the life wheels, and not this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste here. I'm trying to paste here here the name of the deck. I cut it, cut this, and I paste here. These things should bring the name of the deck here or here. I, I don't understand why they don't do that. It's something that sounds so basic. Okay, so there's the tokens. There's no thing now to take out. I think it's good that they're saving paper. They have only six tokens now. Let's see the reference guide for this deck. Fade a minion, how to play the deck. The commander rules. 
as the guy or the girl, I don't know. And some lore about Thanguil, the Duke. So it's a guy, Duke of Splendor. At mere 400 years old, Tegwil is a relative newcomer to the high fae politics in Twinvale. Handsome and quick-witted, he considered himself a natural fit in the refined court of the kind Lord Talion. But like a sapling that grows meekly in the shade of the canopy above it, his ambitions were out of reach. He was pushed to the side, his, young, his youth a curse and Miss Talion's complex courtly ceremonies. However, the shadow proved to be perfect, to be a perfect shroud for a cunning upstart like Tegwil, which stages out of his grasp, it took whatever advantage came in his way. Instead, he needed allies, and assuming ones, that could move unnoticed and uninhabited through the wilds. And Tegwil knew exactly who to contact. Alala, a lesser fairy and a schemer like himself, so should be the second commander. It was a natural, of course, for the high fate to look down upon their fairy relatives. But there were no better eyes and ears for Tegwil than the feeding mischievous fairies that serve Alala in the droves. After an absence of many years, Tegwil made his return with a lavish coming. Lavish coming? Sorry, sometimes it's difficult for me to read from, from the, the phone, right? Escorted by flights of fairies, it was both announced of his return to court and a sight of his intentions. The celebration lasted nearly a year, with Tegwil whispering silky words. Mm -hmm. Okay. We understand that. So let's see this deck. We got it. Where, whoa, there's two. Two easy openings, or this is just fake thing? No, it's look like two we see here and here, but should be just only one. The other one is a, it's just bad plastic. Okay, I see the strip here. Is it, or is it like a mirage? Also a mirage. Okay, so you see there are two plastic strips. One here, one there. Wow, so this is the worst plastic sh sh Okay, so there's another one. There we go. Here was a, the true one, not the Mirage one. Okay. Cool! So, there's the, the tokens now come together. Makes perfect sense. Less, less um, plastic that goes into recycling so let's see the two commanders here they are so that's the reference card that so don't go away and we got tag wheel three mana two three flying and death touch death touch is always good other fairies you control get plus one plus one whenever another fairy you control dies you draw a card and you lose one life that's bad because i guess fairies will die a lot and if you lose one life so what's the big deal with this guy? So he's a flying, the death touch, gives fair. Mm, I'm not getting it unless the deck itself, because it speaks about deceiving, whatever, maybe when you lose life, there are some strategies for getting life back or doing worse damage to the opponent. And there's Alela, the cunning conqueror. Flying to four, four mana. Whenever you cast your first spell during each opponent's turn, opponent's turn, so lots of instants, Create a 1-1 one, one black fairy creature token with flying. Whenever one or more fairies you control deal combat damage to a player, goad target creature that player controls. So goad is force to attack another player, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so looks cool, looks cool. So you create the tokens and the tokens die. That now the deal damage and you goad creatures. So you can you can put the other players fighting each other. That's always a good thing. Ah. Let's see the rest of the deck. I'm curious. Archmage of Echoes. Copy spells. That's good. That's good. That's all, always good. And it works for fairies and wizards. So basically, every creature is probably. Malleable. Imposter. Flash. Flash your zero. And there is a copy of a creature in opponent controls, except it's a fair ship in addition to any card. Okay, okay, this is always good. 
copying creatures opponents control so you have a big dragon i i also have <laughs> it's okay misleading signpost so I, I won't be able to that's an artifact okay i won't be able to read everything so creature fairy shadow puppeteers like with bandit fairy blade crafter netling nuisance so that's that's commander yes tag wheel scoring brazen bow there's a missing here so it's an adventure okay d true time fairy formation glen elandra archmage a lobster <laughs> Old Breaker Aura. I think this this is very this is a very old card. I think it's a reprint. Illusionist Gambit, the Midnight Clock. That's what Cinderella hears when she is, needs to go back. Reflections of Lijara. Sire of Una. Sour of Temptation. Theoretical Duplication. Kindred Dominance. Wow, so beautiful the artwork here. Choose a creature, destroy a creature that aren't the chosen type. <laughs> so I just do board wipe, but only fairies stay. It's better than board wipe. Puppeteer, click, clicky. So, so the fairies are controlling the, the clothes. Rankle Master of Pranks. Trialing in core, trilling in core. Glen Elandra Leech. Fairy Knight. Nimris, Una's trickster. Una, Queen of Fae. Una is someone famous here. Okay, lands. Typical lands that you always get. Mocking Sprite, Picklock Prankster. Spell Shudder. Opira, the Dreaming Duelist. Spell Scorn Coven, Arcane Denial, Cloud of Fairies. Oh, the fairies that existed on Sacus Legacy, right? Or Destiny. Yes, the untapped thing. I think it was a cloud of fairies. They are back now. Distant melody. Wow. Printing search also reprint. Some of the names I recognize. Nightwing Sprite, Opt, Quickling, Reality Shift, Reconnaissance Mission, Repulse, Run Away Together, Run Away Together. Oh, Snap, also from Saga, Ursus Saga. Reckless Sprite, Sprite, Allo Forger. And, okay, so we are getting now to the regular ones. Commander Tower, as expected, yeah. Temple of a False God. Islands. They are basic islands from Wings of Eldraine. Now what to expect here. And the swamps as well. That's the deck, that's the deck. Just a quick look here at the, the Plastic Commander. The tokens, fairies, fairies, more fairies. Copies, so many copy things we saw. Fairies and pirates. How are we? How are we? There we go. Winds of Eldrain, Fade Dominion. Looks cool. Looks cool. I will enjoy it. I hope you do. So, if so, leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe and um, be part of this community. Check my, my channel. I truly invite you to see all the magic content that I have there. And I will have much more. So, I hope that you can consider subscribing and be a part of this community for the next one. Thank you. Goodbye.